discuss uh, one of my recent visit to the rice mill where uh, I seen different uh, induction motors 20 HP 15 HP and 7.5 HP and uh, 3 and 5 HP induction motors are there and uh, they are uh, yeah, they are using for uh, harvesting the uh, groundnut oil and um, rice from the seeds and uh, some other uh, some other floor machines also there so you can watch this video you can get how hard the machines are working in the actual scenario and uh, how the starters are there and the uh, capacitor bank is there for it and uh, how they are using the pulleys and uh, the belt conveyor system for transmitting the power from uh, the motor to the the entire uh, system so you can see it and uh, you can feel it uh, so this is how the motors are working yeah yeah keep watch this video till the end you can get some better understanding if you have any questions or comments then please comment in comment section yeah this is a 20 hp induction motor whatever you are watching here this uh, induction motor we are using for uh, ground net uh, harvesting and uh, ground net uh, say peel off of uh, the seeds and uh, this is the machine so you have you can see the pulley arrangement and everything this is the rice uh, uh, rice harvesting and uh, rice seeds harvesting and um, so here we need more huge amount of torque for rotating the system here you can see ground net oil harvesting uh, machine so here this is a 7.5 this is a 7.5 hp induction motor so yeah you can see how how they are transmitting and uh, how the ma machine is uh, rotating here so all the all the things the thing is that uh, from the induction motor the whatever the torque is producing that we are transmitting to this uh, mechanical equipment through some um, belt conveyor system so that belt transmits the power so here you can see how it is uh, rotating so here this is the starter so we for each uh, motor we have a dedicated starter so you can see that and this is a three phase uh, three phase induction motor and the three phase starter and you can see how the belt is rotating here and uh, how you can see here how the oil is uh, coming out and uh, you can see the ground nut seeds in the machine and uh, this is the very big pulley arrangement and this is the, this was run by 15 hp induction motor yeah we have different makes siemens crompton grace volt amp and uh, many other uh, different makes of uh, motors here and uh, this is some other machines for uh, harvesting yeah you can see how how the oil uh, oil is uh, oozing out from the machine yeah so whenever we are crushing the groundnut seeds in the machine then the oil is uh, oozing so we are filtering the oil here so yeah so after uh, drying out we can use it for uh, consumption yeah here you can see dye in the close up view how oil is coming out from the machine yeah you can feel the um, how how hardly the motors are working to produce a to, to required a torque uh, and a mechanical power yeah so this is the byproduct of our ground net uh, seeds we can use for uh, 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 cattle and um, cows buffaloes uh, as, a, as a feed uh, you can see well, how the process is here so whenever you are designing any motor or uh, any alternator you can think of it uh, how how hard the machine is going to work in the actual scenario yeah this is the oil or oil coronet oil finally we are set you can see here the lines of our droplets how it is uh, falling into the tin here yeah so th th this is about this uh, guys so here you can see the belt arrangement we have we used uh, two belt here for the motor here you can see the big uh, big pieces of uh, byproduct uh, of uh, this uh, ground net oil here ground net seeds here so the, this is a uh, 15 hp 
induction motor as I, I already told yeah so one thing is uh, this, uh, yeah, this is a uh, rice the so rice mill so uh, we are harvesting uh, rice rice from these uh, paddy seeds uh, yeah so this is the motor in a hall picture you can see how the fuse arrangement starter arrangement and we have a capacitor bank also yeah this is a close-up view of this uh, motor 7 15 hp induction motor this is the starter you, we have a capacitor bank also nearby this uh, starter so capacitor bank we are using for phasing the uh, starting current and uh, also it improves the power factor of the entire plant yeah the, we have another machines also here so 3 hp and 5 hp for this um, other floor machines of, of, yeah so this is about this uh, entire uh, rice mill guys i hope uh, the content is useful to you just it, it will just give you an uh, out, uh, idea how 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 the motors are working uh, what are the environmental conditions how hard harsh what harsh conditions they are working yeah this is the capacitor so 5 kv or capacitor and uh, 440 volts and 50 heads yeah for bigger machine we used uh, two capacitors in parallel for fading the cordons and th this is star delta starter uh, so in starting it is star and uh, then in finally in delta condition you can see the fuse also the white box is the capacitor bank actually you can see the fuse also how the fuse is uh, kind of the connected yeah so this is the cap capacitor arrangement you can see here so this is the max starter yeah generally the motor used in uh, these uh, rice rice mill and all are of uh, second hand i mean uh, they used they use uh, used motors so generally if you want to purchase any new machine so it will it will cost around 60 to 70 thousand a normal 15 hp induction motor but what we most of the people will do is uh, they will purchase uh, already used one so generally used one will uh, come for uh, around uh, thousand to two thousand rupees per hp yeah so this is about this guys thank you thanks for watching thank you friends thank you thanks for watching this is about this uh, video yeah subscribe to this channel so that uh, whenever i'm uploading videos you will get notifications yeah we'll meet in next video bye